In this video, I'll be making the braces on my pergola look better by cutting some curves and rounding the edges. For those of you who think that I should have done this originally when I first built the pergola, you're right. However, no time like the present to rectify a mistake. I'll start by undoing the structural screws holding the braces to the posts and the beams. Before I removed the braces, I made marks where they overlapped the beams so that I had an idea of where to cut the curves. Here I'm transferring the line back a bit since I don't want the curve to go all the way to the post and beam. I'm using a couple of C-clamps as guides where I want the curves to start. Then I bend a flexible ruler to the depth I want to form the curve. Here I'm going for an effective width of 3.5 inches, the same as a 2x4, for the curved portion of the brace. Cutting this is very easily done with a bandsaw. I'm using a half inch blade. If you don't have one, a jigsaw will work, but the results won't be as smooth. It's a good idea to make a couple of relief cuts before you start cutting the curve, unlike what I did. I used the first brace as a template for the curve on the second one. To soften the cut edges, I run a 3 16 inch round over bit over them with a palm router. Again, in hindsight, I should have done this to all the cut edges on all the pieces, originally. To give the bottoms of these braces a bit more strength, I'm using these 3 8 inch Spax leg screws. To give the head somewhere to go, I create a counterbore using a Forstner bit of an appropriate size. Then, I drew through the piece with a long drill bit matching the root diameter of the screw. To make the braces easier to attach, I drive in the structural screws just enough so that the points stick out. This way, they can index into the existing holes in the posts.
I then used the long drill bit again to pre-drill the posts to keep the spack screws from splitting them. braces on my pergola are mounted on the sides of the posts due to the second story overhang on my house, so they'll be a little different than the front ones. However, the process for cutting the curves is exactly the same. viewer pointed out that the bottoms of these braces would be potential head knockers for people walking by, so I'm softening these by trimming the corners. I think the upgraded braces are a great change to the look of the pergola, don't you? Leave me a comment below and let me know what you think. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.